Here we have a grand room with clouds of niceness and brass and marble and textures. I won't say anything negative. I appreciate this. It could have had just a screen in black like so many other games do. Just give me a room I could exist in, move around and it's good stuff. I appreciate it. Yep, so here we are with the campaign. Oh, that was a good tactile feeling. Indeed. Immerse yourself in the full version of Brass Tactics. Become an expert scion in the 8 mission campaign. Play solo or online with 8 competitive maps or join with a friend against 3 distinct AI personalities on 6 cooperative maps. Customize your 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 your, your unit palette and team colors. Available now at the Oculus Store. Oculus, baby. Where the gaming is at. Oculus, come on down and grab the hat. Alright. Campaign level one. Woo! Playing it normal. The wall table. Scion newcomer. In the desert sacred to the Blue Lady, you face a reluctant opponent and learn to use the war table. Reluctant opponent, desert, Blue Lady, facing him. You can command a large number of units at once by holding the trigger and sweeping your hand. Oh boy. Ah, you're here. And thank the Blue Lady for that. Thank you. Now, you must have an imperial ton of questions. I know. I'm sorry. I wish we had found you sooner, but... For right now, what you need to know is that Princep Savolto is encroaching into our territory. He's already taken over several city-states, and the devil is trying to claim our ferrous magnet mines, which are vital for my Titan project. So let's get started. In front of you is my responsibility and my joy. Our war table, where all the action takes place. You can raise and lower the table by grabbing and adjusting it with both hands, like this. Oh, now yeah. you try. Squeeze both grip buttons simultaneously to raise or lower the table until it is about waist high. Good. Oh boy. You can also move the table around by grabbing it with one hand and sliding it like so. <gasps> this allows you to quickly access any part of the battlefield with a flick of a wrist. Oh. Give it a shot. Oh, that feels Squeeze so one good. Grip button and pull to move the table to get a closer look at the enemy castle. That's where Princeps Jero is situated. So many names, I know. He's one of Zavolto's vassals, but don't worry. He doesn't know about you yet. You you pick that up very quickly. Take a moment to try moving the table in different directions. Now move backwards to our castle, so we can build our first tower. Towers are placed in open round sockets, like the one in front of our castle. Turn your wrist, palm up, until the pallet appears. Oh. With your other hand, grab a tower with your trigger, and put it in the round socket. Oh, let's do some, uh, warriors. Oh, it's so Perfect. good and... Now we have a tower. Down. Man. Towers allow us to train squads, which increase our military strength. To train a squad, touch one of our towers to highlight it, then press A. You've queued up a squad. Tower map. You can queue up to three squads at a time at each tower. After a short time, the squad will appear on the battlefield next to the tower. Just like that. Beautiful. To command our squad, squeeze the trigger and point at it. While still holding the trigger, point where you want it to go and release the trigger. So, so far... I could do it now. I'll keep holding this. So, so far... Uh, all these decisions about the button clicks, this sort of feeling... Hear that? It's such a... I have to let go now. Jero's warrior squad is stationed nearby. 
To attack, select your squads using the trigger. Point at an enemy squad and release. So all these decisions about like the button clicks, this weird sound that happens, and the speed that it opens up, the shine, it's all very, 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 very One to go. The speed of this and the clicks, hear the clicks? And it's spatial, it's over there. And the fact that I can't rotate it, that's a good thing, because it's, it, it's locked in, but it still feels like something real is happening. Oh boy. Get him. I knew it. That's exactly how Princeps Moravia would have worked. Excellent. Now let's capture that region next to our castle before Jero's forces do. Will do. First, move a squad to the highlighted tower socket. It will open up for you when your squad arrives. Okay. Now that the socket is open, place a tower onto it, just like before. Okay. Remember to turn your wrist so your palm faces upward to access the tower pallet. Uh, that thing, yep. You've taken control oh, so of this crisp, region. man. Captured regions produce ore and jewels for us, which we need to train squads, build towers, and upgrade our castle. Take a look at your wrists. Your gauntlets show your current resource totals, as well as the amount of your next jewel payout. Spend ore to train new squads. Spend jewels to construct towers, add upgrades to our castle, build turrets, or to help train elite unit squads. Mm. Let's upgrade our castle, which hasn't seen improvement since Princeps Moravia's time. <gasps> First, move back behind our castle. Oh, man. Yep. Next, there. grab an upgrade from the drawer using the trigger. Oh. Place it onto a square socket next to the castle and release. What does that do? Build walls, faster move at home. I like that. Excellent. Castle Ooh. upgrades can improve the strengths of our squads, oh my improve our economic God. efficiency, and a region's defensive capability. Botheration. Jero is connecting to us from his war room. Hmm. Roliano de Leroldo. You are going to tell me they have me facing an architect today? Princeps Jero. <clears throat> Lovely weather. Intonago? It is. Plus, I am surprised you recognize it as such. The desert is greatly underappreciated. Well, let's <laughs> get on with it. Who is your new scion? I could ask you the same question. I've disabled the communicatus, which ordinarily allows scions to talk to each other. I'd rather that he not know who you are yet. Your identity needs to stay secret until I can finish my project. Awesome. Let's move in and take our regions back from Jero's forces. We should act swiftly and press the advantage, while he still underestimates our capabilities. Do you see the destructible wall just ahead? It blocks our path to the next region. Destroy the wall by attacking it directly. Ah, oh, you grabbed them. Get him. Get him. Yee Get him, you bloody stone. Strike and be merciful. Indeed. Blarney stones up in the hizzy. This way, human. Maximum units. Nice. You looted some ore and jewels from that resource cache. You are going to be distinctly annoying, I see.
Keep going. Destroy the enemy towers and squads in this region, then capture it. I'll wait for this group to come. Bring the front line over here. Get the infantry in front. Get all the archers ready. Get these guys sieged over here. Oh boy. Back, back, back. Now a strike. 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 Flank them. Flank them. Yes. This way, this way. This way, human. Get the front line. Squad limit reached. Good. Good. That means we're doing good, human. Good, good. Let's go this way. We don't have to go this way, but we want to. Actually, let's just wait. Wait right here. Keep the wall. I'll break the wall over one up. Now we have to strike. Damn. Damn. Tear it down. Strike it down. Indeed, you do. You ride. On the dusty trail, you ride. <laughs> oh, well done indeed. Thank this you. region has been cleared of enemies. Let's capture it. Remember to move a squad next to the tower socket to open it up. Hmm. Oil production increased. Better nurtures. This is no slot. Since we placed two upgrades, we've upgraded our castle to level two. Upgrading the castle allows for us to train more total squads and makes the towers and castle tougher to destroy. In later missions, it will also unlock additional upgrades and elite squads. <laughs> oh, well done indeed. This region has been cleared of enemies. Let's capture it. Remember to move a squad next to the tower socket to open it up. Our castle has advanced. We may now build elite unit towers. <laughs> oh, well done indeed. This region has been cleared of enemies. Let's capture it. Yep. Remember to move a squad next to the tower socket to open it up. Eight. Oh, I guess I have to still capture it. Duh. I guess I can't break it up now. I'm just gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Get over here, guys. All of you. Everyone. Now I shall capture it with caliber. <laughs> oh, well done indeed. This region has been cleared of enemies. Stuff. Let's capture it. Remember to move a squad next to the tower socket to open yeah, it up. Yeah, yeah, we got it, we got it. All the you, you captured my region. I don't Thank even you. know who you are. Indeed. Ha, wouldn't he like to know? With this region captured, we only have one more to take back from Jero, so we can reach his castle. Nice looking. Looks as though Jero is going to attack. What? We can defend our region by spending jewels to build a turret, if one is available to us. Find the turret node in the region we just captured. Touch the turret node and press A. This costs us jewels, but turrets are automatic and powerful. Oh, turret node. Duh. After the turret node. That's it. Sweet. Turrets provide additional defense to their surrounding area. Jero's cavalry is closing in. Now our turret will prove its effectiveness. Ride. The enemy has entered our territory. Draggers. <laughs> Get the tower to pull the aggro first. <laughs> the last enemy region is on top of the hill. Let's build up and take it. Ease back a little bit, just a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. I want you. Go back. I have Thank high you. ground. Careful. Jero's got archers at the top of the ramp. Ranged units shoot further from high ground, so you will have a hard time charging them uphill. I'd recommend gathering a force of at least five squads before trying to take them out.
ride. Back up, back up, back up. Pull them away. Pull them away, pull them away. Fight them off the hill. Pull them off the hill, that's the, that's the goal. Pull them off the hill. Now we use the horses. Everybody else, attack. Crossbow. Got it. Indeed, baby. Oh, 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 boy. All right. Uh, mm, 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 there we go. Okay, we need to pull the horses over here. I like those horses. Okay. You too. Get over here. Remember to destroy all towers and enemies in a region to capture. Yep. Strike now. Let's capture the region. And oh, archery. Excellent. This region is a multi-socket region. <laughs> this region has two sockets. Once you capture one with a tower, the other will open automatically. Placing a second one will increase your income and make it harder for the enemy to take over. Right. No, no. You have full ownership over all the regions, which Indeed. I grant is how business is done. But Zavarto will be displeased. <laughs> I bet he will. All that's left is destroying the enemy castle. <laughs> Lady, Jero has really lost his fire. Rumor has it that Zavarto is holding his sigh on his hostage. I'm not sure I believe it because... I mean, territories change hands, but families are sacred. Now it's time to remove Jero from his castle and drive him from this place. Indeed. You've got control of many regions now, so train up a good-sized force of squads and command them to destroy the well, defense towers. I am full. Then move on to Jero's castle. Wait a second. Oh, He'll wait. be training new squads now that his back is against in. the wall, so watch out. Good luck. Destroy Jero's castle so we can seal this victory. I'll call let the it a first day. wave come in and attack while they're distracted. The enemy has invaded our territory. Cannot build towers in the enemy's home region. Let's press on and destroy their castle. Go, go, go. You have your orders? Scion with a bright future. 
What sort of toothless battle were you playing at, Jero? Ah, being kept Savoltor. Uh, I was simply trying to conserve resources. And... You bile swallowing dog fart. You just Whoa. needed to counter their archers with cavalry and cavalry with warriors. A child could have held this region. Cavalry with warriors. You see why I disabled the communicatus. Otherwise, they could hear us. But thank the blue lady, I was right about you. Well done. Truly. If we didn't have this region and its ferrous magnets, our Titan project would be at a standstill. I just wish they were enough by themselves. True. High quality. Our forces are victorious. Awesome, man. Awesome. Freaking awesome. Campaign, level two. Denigo Coliseum, advanced squad combat before pursuing Garo. Rolianu offers some extended training in commanding your troops. Cool. So far, so good. This is Brass Tactics. Welcome to Brass Tactics. Denego Coliseum, where scions come to spar and print caps to find new talent. I'm a print it's cap. a useful training ground because scions don't have to worry about damage, except to their reputations. Most people have more trouble with the table the first time than you did. Mm. But don't let that make you cocky. Man. I've seen so many bright young potential scions completely come apart when faced with the number of decisions they have to make. I want to yeah. run you through some more advanced techniques before we face another Scion. I'm down. For practice, I'll be your opponent this round. Oh Look boy. at the arena and find your warrior squad. Right there, buddy. Now, command your warrior squad to attack my cavalry. Get him. Oh boy. Well, I see the life around the edge, yeah. Come on, buddy. We win. Notice how your warriors fared better than my cavalry? Yes. That's because it's melee combat, which warriors are designed for. Yeah, so good looking. Try so. attacking my archers with your warriors. Yeah. Well, they fared pretty well, but uh, archers win. Archers See how win. your warriors didn't do well against archers? Yes. Archers can inflict damage from a distance, so you need to get inside their range quickly. Ah, cavalry. Attack my archers again, but this time use your cavalry. Very well. Get him. Exactly so. Cavalry can cover ground with their charge attack, which forces ranged units to engage in melee, in addition to the damage the cavalry delivers on impact. Else. Let's cover a few more advanced squad commands, shall we? To select multiple squads at once, squeeze the trigger as far as it goes and point at your squads. I know how to do it. This allows you to give each of these squads the same command at the same time. To select a single squad for a special assignment, squeeze the trigger part way and point at the squad you want to act alone. Okay. Ah, I see. So now you go this way. You go there this you way. Go. You two go, uh, Selecting a single squad you three go that is way. for positioning you go that specific way. squads in strategic locations. You two go that way. Rather than telling Just your to squads to attack a target, you can command them to go to a location while engaging enemies along the way. To initiate an attack move command, select your squads, then push up on the thumbstick. 
Now that you've engaged the attack move command, your squads will attack move to any location you select when you release the trigger. Uh, you go this way, but just you go that way and kill stuff. Well done. Princeps Moravia said that she used the attack move command in situations where she could trust her commanders to engage the enemy, which Everything freed her attention for be. strategic oversight. Indeed. The Pretty last caps. command is hold position, which tells your squads to remain in place and not to move for any reason. I think. To initiate hold position, select <laughs> your squads and push down on the thumbstick. Oh. I remember it is down to stay and up to go. Stay still. That's it. Hold position is useful when you need your squads to hold a line. It hold helps the them line. avoid getting lured out of formation by enemy squads. Gotcha. Looking over my list... Right. Those are the primary squad commands. Multi-selection, single selection, attack move, and hold position. Now it gets interesting. Elite Ooh. squads. Some elite squads have interactable abilities that empower them. Let's start by finding your artillery squad in the arena. The artillery can pack up and move around as a normal squad, but... I love this. Try touching the artillery and pressing the A button. Hey. What? See how it's transforming? Yeah. It's now unpacked and can bombard targets from afar. Press A on it again. The artillery does this amazing, graceful repacking, and now it can be located, nimble, and deadly. Ah, there's a range. The more battles you have under your belt, the more you'll grasp the nuances of each squad and how to take advantage range. of their abilities. I think you'll grasp this on your own, but yeah. I do want to give you a quick overview of squad upgrades. Upgrades improve squads by giving them bonuses or different tactical advantages. For example, Take a look at your warriors in the arena. These warriors have the stealth warrior upgrade track and can be extremely effective if used properly. Mm. Move them to attack my archers and see what happens. Indeed. Normally, warriors are not a good choice against archers, but... Get them. Had to jump on you. Had to jump on you. The stealth warriors engage in melee with the archers before the archers have a chance to attack. As you can see, upgrades can completely alter the outcome of combat. Every squad type has an upgrade track at your castle. Mm. As you develop as a scion, you'll learn to take full advantage of the strengths of each upgrade track. Indeed. So. Shall we put all of that theory to practical use? Yes. Best me in combat, and then we'll press on to Nadane to get some new you. equipment to help us face Zavalto. Okay. Remember, warriors are strong against cavalry. Cavalry is strong against archers, and archers are strong against warriors. Should have moved in my stealth first. That worked out. Okay, here we go again. All right, we're electric. That'll probably make them visible. Okay, cavalry against archers. Electric, I guess. 
Now the fire is burning us up. Well, that didn't work out. Huh. Didn't if explain at first that one, you buddy. don't succeed. Didn't explain it. Okay, so these guys have extra armor. Uh, If at first Man. you don't succeed. Why is it gotta be all hard now, huh? Why is it gotta be all hard now? Well. Did it, baby. That was hard, bastards. It's gonna get harder now, huh? What the heck is that it's supposed to be, huh? Okay, that's your crazy swords, freaking these guys, and uh, so I guess I'll pull these. Oh, okay, we have artillery. You got to shoot. Get him. Well done. Well, that worked out. There are some scholars at the academy that I've been wanting to consult with about the Titan. Good stuff, baby. Good stuff. Yeehaw! I'm learning. Soon I'll have an actual game going on. So it says I have to do the single player game, uh, the, you know, the campaign. Then I have to do the uh, couple AI matches. And then on those set days, at those set times, I have to try to play some multiplayer games. 